It's a wonderful feeling to be Neapolitan and to play for my home team. I wish that all the youngsters from Naples, who, like me, always dreamt of wearing the Napoli shirt, could achieve this and play at the San Paolo Stadium. Naples loves to have a hero. And in recent years, the Stadio San Paolo has seen the emergence of another idol. He's from a local family by the name of Insigne. I played with my brother for a few minutes during a league match, and we sometimes train together. It's always great to play and have fun together with a brother or a friend. Some have called him the Italian Messi. The more optimistic fans of Napoli even compared him to Maradona. But what's not in doubt is that Insigne's goals and pace have been a big part of Napoli's Serie A title challenge. It's the local lad made good. Napoli is a big club. And football here is very important. I grew up here, so it's my home team. I don't know much about other clubs, but I can assure you that Napoli is great and always takes care of us. It's a great feeling because I am from Naples and it's nice to go around the city and see someone wearing a shirt with my name and number on it. I'm proud of that and I will always give my best. Insigne operates mainly as a left-sided forward. He scored 28 goals for Napoli, but it's his first goal that lives long in the memory. I still remember it because it was Napoli versus Parma. It was a great thrill to score my first goal at the San Paolo wearing the Napoli shirt. And I hope to bring more joy to this team and especially to the fans who really deserve it. This season, Insigne has been an important part of a Napoli team that's launching a serious title challenge. Could it be that the Scudetto trophy will make the long journey south to Naples for the first time since 1990? It would not only mean a lot to the team, but also to the fans, because it's been 30 years since we won the title. So we want to make this dream come true, and we'll try to give our best until the very end, so we can give our fans something great to celebrate. This year, our new coach, Maurizio Sari, has certainly taught us a lot, and we're trying to make sure everyone is involved and feels important, from the first player on the team sheet to the last, even those who don't play that much. We will battle to the very end for him because he's a good coach and he's helped us a great deal. Insigne is slowly establishing himself in the Italian national team. Despite Italy's early exit, coming on as a substitute in the FIFA World Cup against Costa Rica was one of the most memorable moments of his career. I'm very proud to have been able to play in a World Cup because I was only 23 years old. It was a wonderful experience, even if it didn't go too well for Italy. Being able to play in a World Cup, especially in Brazil, doesn't happen every day. So it was very pleasing, and I hope to play in more World Cups. I hope to go to the Euros. I'm doing my best to try and impress Antonio Conte, and I hope to get the call. But it's his decision. I think it will be a great European Championship, then I hope we can make our mark and get to the final. Another World Cup star, Argentina's Gonzalo Higuain, is forming a productive partnership with Insigne at the San Paolo. Gonzalo. I think Gonzalo is the best striker in the world because he scored 24 goals in 24 matches. On the pitch, though, it isn't just about myself and Gonzalo. There are 11 players, and if we're near the top of the league, then it's down to the whole team because we all work for one another. Back in Naples, the benchmark has always been Diego Maradona the man who led the team to their last Serie A title in 1990. Could Insigne get anywhere close to the ultimate Neapolitan hero? I think all the players would like to wear that number, but Maradona's number 10 is untouchable because he gave us so much wearing that shirt. I'm just happy to wear the number 24, so I'll carry on doing so. These comparisons with Maradona make me very proud. 
He did a lot for Napoli. Whereas at the moment, we are just at the beginning and we have to carry on what we are doing now.